and the founder of our firm, Gordon Elliott, he believed in the chamber. He was, he was so involved from the very beginning. Uh, he believed in the partnership. He believed in the value of what the chamber brought to the community, and, and he was always very active uh, in the Chamber of Commerce. So that's how we got started, and we've never looked back from that. And we, we just believe it's the right thing to do. And I know that they're an advocate for small businesses, and we're, we're one of those. I've been to Jefferson City multiple times, but it was certainly a unique experience uh, representing the Chamber of Commerce. I had never done anything like that before in my long life that I've lived so far, so it was really, uh, I won't say I was anxious about the day, but I didn't know what was going to happen. It was amazing to me, number one, how organized the staff had our day. You can tell they're, uh, the people that do that, they're very, very passionate about what they do. The amount of respect that the legislators, uh, including leadership in Jefferson City, have for our Springfield Area uh, Chamber of Commerce. Uh, it's uh, very obvious that they respect uh, you know, what we're doing. Um, they respect our leadership and um, you know, they, uh, they look to us for uh, feedback and, and guidance as well, which I think says a lot. All of them made time for us. Um, they're all interested in what we have to, on our minds, uh, what we think is important, uh, what we'd like them to consider. And so um, I felt the day was awesome. I, I really don't know what I was expecting, but um, it turned out really, really well. And, and I believe that, that our involvement in that day every year is important for the community. I think we get a lot of things done by having regular communication. And that was articulated to us on that day by many of the people that we talked to. So definitely worthwhile.